Welcome to the Green Mind facility. This is a tomato grocery and we have a bunch of miners there and we're gonna today we're gonna install a container where they're gonna be under the oil. We're gonna make a green solution for mining. And there is our container coming from the other side of the country. So and here's the the factory which built it and there is our container which consists of about 60 miners. The whole concept is that we are able to take all the heat of the miners and to help it to grow tomatoes. And this grocery generates about 10 million kilos of tomatoes a year and has its own power supply of 5 megawatt. 95% of the electricity which is used by miners is generated into heat and the idea is to put that directly into the heating system of the glass houses which we have a lot of here in the Netherlands. And these greeneries use a lot of electricity and if you wonder why take a look at this. And this is the place where the heating and the electricity is generated. We'll take a look at it later. Greeneries have a big connection to the grid and directly next to it we are going to put the container. And how easy can it be? We have hot water in, cold water out and we have the electricity. Extremely sophisticated uh, technology. So concrete plates and this is a 50 kilowatt electricity connection. Oh yeah, welcome to Holland. It rains like crazy. So we're gonna do this in the rain, but no problem. Raining cats and dogs. That's really what's happening now. Ugh. But nobody is being stopped. We're gonna get that sucker on this place. Okay. Okay, and there goes the container. How much kilo is it? I don't know, uh, 500 <laughs> I think. Yeah, so a thousand kilos. There's about 60 miners in there. So this container came from the other side of the country, which is about 150 kilometers. <laughs> and it will be together about 2,000, uh, two tons. Okay, make sure we put it in the right way. So, okay, yeah, wireless, which direction does the container need to go? Okay, there it goes. The eagle has landed. Yep. <laughs> is it straight yeah. okay we're on so that's the oil and here are the miners you get it off good old technology the container, the basis of international trade. So the water arrives. Next is the cooler, which we're going to integrate into the um, glass houses system. Uh, so the, this is standing. End of phase two. Let's go to installing the oil and getting it connected to the electricity grid. Next step. All these miners are in the oil and the oil is now being transferred It's very special oil with a very low velocity and uh, that's now being put into the uh, into the miner container Okay, next phase we're going to get the electricity 
So here we have a 100 kilowatt hour connection, which is going to be distributed over four times 32 amps for free phase in this place. So that's the next step. And in the back, we have two sides, hot water, cold water. And at the moment, we're still using an old fashioned cooler, but it's going to be connected directly into the greenhouse. Next phase is when the electricity is ready, we're going to see if the miners are online. So big moment. The electricity is on. Here is uh, about uh, 50K uh, comes out of there, 60K, 70K. And it goes in three times 32, 1.16. And we're now going to turn it on. First, let's see the other side. Okay. This needs to be looked at. Okay. We are connected. <laughs> the megawatts come out of the, uh, come out of the floor. So there's a total of five megawatt coming out of this. 5,000 kilowatt hours, five million. And there, let there be light. And the pump is working. And the oil is streaming. <laughs> now let's put the miners on. What kind of tools do you need for 100 kilowatt? It rained as much as two months of uh, rain for the whole of Netherlands in one morning. So this is a great moment that we picked to install this.